Hi everybody, welcome to Maslin, Ohio. I was at this location just a few months ago to show you an abandoned location. Things have been changing around here, so let's check it out. Just to refresh your memory a little bit, for those that have seen this other video, right across the street from here is the Menards, and at the time, they were building the Aldi over here. The Aldi is now open for business, and as you can see, the parking lot is pretty full. But it was over here that I showed you the former BJ's florist in Al's greenhouse. It's been in the last couple days they decided that they're gonna finally knock this down. I'm not sure if they're gonna be doing something with the property or if someone just bought it just to get rid of this eyesore, but it's it's pretty much gone. There's not much left to it. That yellow truck that used to be sitting up front looked like they had to tow it back here, along with that other truck behind it. But everything's been completely gutted out of here and there's nothing but a nice great big hole and i'm not going to be going inside of this structure just because it is very unsound very dangerous uh there's the front door you can see that there's a nice gaping hole if i were to try to step inside there i'd just slide right on down inside and get cut up by all this glass but uh yeah all the ceiling tile is Still there for the most part, I guess. You could tell there was another ceiling in there before that at one point, even with the fluorescent lighting above that, which is kind of interesting to see. Well, let me take you around back here. Yeah, check this truck out back here. That looks like it's been sitting back there for a really long time. This is where the greenhouse used to be. Greenhouse is all completely gone. Everything's just nothing but a pile of rubble. And when I tell you this building is structurally unsound, let me show you. See that little wooden post right here? That is the only thing that is holding this thing up right now. So one slip and this thing is going to come crashing down. It doesn't even have to be me that would go in there. Just a little bit of vibration from all this traffic here on Route 21. Could be just enough to uh, cause this to fall or slip or whatever. So yeah, this is as close as I'm going to get. So I do apologize for that. I'm just doing that for my own safety and the safety of my friend from Rich Way uh, Video Productions that's tagging along here with me. But yeah, there was a... I don't think this was a basement of any kind, but... This is pretty much what's left of it. I know this video is pretty short, but... Uh, it's pretty much all there is to see here, so I'll just give you one more view here. Then I'll go back up into the front. But if anyone in the area happens to know of uh, what might be going in into this place, let me know in the comment section. Everybody, that was just a quick update of what's left of the BJ Flores and Al's greenhouse here in Masson, Ohio. Uh, like I said, if anyone has any idea what's going to be happening here, let me know in the comment section below. In the meantime, thank you all for watching. Keep it real, and I will see you in the next video.